Hey guys, I'm Paul the Motor Guy. Now in this video, I'm going to talk about how to use the throttle when doing slow speed maneuvers. So hang tight. Now the first tip when it comes to the throttle is you want to have what we call reserve RPMs. Now depending on what bike you're riding, your RPMs or revolutions per minute may vary. Now when I'm doing slow speed maneuvers on my Road King, my RPMs are between 12 to 1500. Now on my Kawasaki Concourse, they usually run around 1800 to 2000. Now this does not have to be exact. I just don't recommend you idling through your turns. Now I'm going to do some figure eights and 360s on both my Road King and my Concourse. As you're watching, I want you to notice that on both bikes, the RPMs may fluctuate a little bit while I'm in my turns. So again, you don't have to be perfect with this. You just don't want to idle. So let's check it out. Now let me give you two reasons why I think having reserve RPMs is important. The first one is if I have reserve RPMs, I have power that's stored up, ready to be transferred to the rear wheel. So if I have the motorcycle leaned over and I feel like the motorcycle is falling and I let out a little more clutch, the motorcycle is more responsive because of that stored up power. Now the second reason is again, if I have the motorcycle leaned over and I feel like it's falling and I let out a little more clutch too fast, it reduces the chance of me stalling the motorcycle which you know stalling motorcycle while it's leaning over is never a good thing. Earlier I mentioned that I don't recommend you idling when making your turns. So let me give you two reasons why. The first one is that if I'm idling through my turns, the motorcycle is more sluggish because it doesn't have that stored up power. Now the second reason is if I'm idling and accidentally let out too much clutch too fast, I risk the chance of stalling the motorcycle. Now let's move on to tip number two, which is you have to have constant throttle or RPMs when the motorcycle is leaned over. One of the common things I see is that riders will roll on and off the throttle like a dirt bike while they're making their turns. Now, if you've been to a motorcycle rodeo, you may hear the Harley guys rolling on and off the throttle. But if you pay attention to this, this is usually done while the motorcycle is still straight up and down. But when they start their turns, they will usually have constant throttle or RPMs. If you set the throttle, then it's one less thing you have to worry about. Now, in this next video, I'm going to show my throttle hand. Now you don't want to be looking down at your tachometer to see your RPMs. You need to listen to your bike. It will let you know if it needs more throttle. Now we all know what a motorcycle sounds like when it wants to stall. Now I personally think it's better to have too much throttle than not enough. You can always roll off the throttle if you hear that it's too high. Now I'm going to do some more figure eights in 360s and show you the overall view so you can hear what it sounds like to have constant RPMs. Now,
And I hope this video gave you some insight on how to use your throttle when it comes to slow speed maneuvers. Now, until next time, you got it. Practice, 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 and ride safe.